Welcome to Med Seekers. In this video, we'll be talking about latest admission announcement by various universities for Masters in Public Health program for the academic year 2023. If you are an MPH aspirant, do watch out this video completely because I have covered all the important information, eligibility criteria, entrance exam dates, mainly application dates and entrance exam syllabus with the sample papers. I hope this video will definitely help you out. Without a further delay, let's jump into today's video. So first we'll start with PG Mar Chandigarh Post Graduate Institute of Medical Education and Research. It is an institute of national importance. They have various medical research and training facilities for students. From MPH notification has been released. You can go to this official website pgmar.edu.in and download the prospectus. Starting date of MPH application is from April 25th April. Application closing date is on 15th May 2023. Your correction window will be open on 18th and 19th May. Entrance exam is scheduled on 27th May 2023. You can expect your results around June 7th. This is the expected date for your results. Coming to application fee for PGMR MPH program for general OBC sponsored category it's around 1500 Indian rupees plus transaction charges for SC ST category it's around 1200 plus transaction charges for persons with disabilities they have exempted the application fee coming to how many seats are available for masters in public health program at PGMR Chandigarh general category we have 6 seats OBC 3 seats SC 2 seats ST 1 seat PWD 1 seat for sponsored category we have 2 seats regarding what is sponsored category who will come under sponsored category what is the sponsored category eligibility criteria i have made one special video regarding pgmer on all the sponsored category please watch that specific video regarding pgmer chandigarh i'll drop the link in the description box before going to talk about PGMR MPH eligibility criteria, very important note for all the students. Before you apply for any university, please read the eligibility criteria very carefully. In many of my videos, I have emphasized on eligibility criteria. After explaining eligibility criteria also, some students comment that is so and so degree eligible or not. If you are having doubt regarding eligibility criteria, pause the video and you read the eligibility criteria very carefully and you can check whether your particular degree matches with it or not. Even if you are having doubts, then you can download the prospectus and go through the eligibility criteria in detail. Coming to PGMAR MPH eligibility criteria, candidate must possess MBBS, BDS, BBSc, BE, MA, MSc degrees with 50% of marks in aggregate. And here they have clearly mentioned students must have finished their degree on or before 30th June 2023. For students belonging to SC, ST, OBC, they have given some percentage relaxation. They can have around 45% and they must have completed their degree from recognized universities and they must have registered with their particular council for MBBS medical council, for dental, dental council, veterinary registration council for veterinary students and there is certain important points for students who will be finishing their degree before 30th June 2023 here I have written certain points you can go through that in detail and if you have any queries you can send to their email they have you can download the prospectors there they have written email in the prospectus they have given particular email id pgmar official email id to which particular email you have to send the documents you can download the prospectus for further reference coming to selection criteria it is based on entrance examination you will have entrance exam of 80 marks exam duration is of 90 minutes coming to pgmar mph entrance exam syllabus before uh, preparing for any mph entrance exam please refer to syllabus because every university has different entrance exam syllabus for masters in public health entrance examination for PGMAR you will have 20 marks from each section I mean from English you will have 20 questions from data interpretation you will have 20 questions from general knowledge and awareness you will have 20 questions from intellectual and reasoning skills it's 20 questions this is the syllabus intellectual reasoning skills English and comprehension data interpretation skills general knowledge and awareness and remember there will be negative marking for every wrong answer 
coming to entrance exam details it is a computer based online entrance exam an entrance exam is scheduled to be held on 27th may 2023 and there are only two entrance examination centers one is in chandigarh and one is in delhi punjab university notification for masters in public health program for the academic year 2023 is out these are the important dates and deadlines for application process entrance exam and your result dates please refer to this particular snapshot and mark your calendar application last date is 28th may 2023 and last date to deposit fee is 23rd may 2023 you can la- upload your photograph signature with the rest of the information last date is 25th may 2023 your admit card will be available around june 5th and you can expect your results around july 7th 2023 for further details regarding masters in public health program we'll discuss in detail coming to masters in public health program entrance exam date is 11th june 2023 we have 17 seats for masters in public health program this covers general sc st opc apart from that for sponsored category we have 5 seats nri 2 seats and one foreign national coming to punjab university eligibility criteria mbbs bds bams bhms bvsc bsc nursing life sciences biological sciences with at least 50% marks from recognized university are eligible to apply coming to entrance exam syllabus and pattern they have clearly mentioned that from each particular topic how many questions you can expect total your question paper will have 75 questions each question carries one mark so 75 into 175 25 questions will be from biological sciences 10 will be from social sciences 25 will be from health sciences and medical vocabulary 15 from environmental sciences i'll drop the few book links in the description box for your reference if some students are unaware about which book to refer for each particular subject i'll show you a sample paper released by punjab university for further clarity how to prepare this is a sample question paper released by punjab university itself if you want to download this particular question paper you can download pg punjab university prospectus latest one 2023 one for masters in public health sample paper you have to go to page number 75 there you can see they have given 10 questions this sample questions will give you an idea what kind of questions you can expect in your entrance exam how to prepare for it and they have clearly described entrance exam syllabus also these two will form a strong basic foundation one you have to have your entrance exam syllabus and the second one previous year question papers so so far we have talked about pgmer and punjab university 2023 admission updates now we'll talk about university of lucknow masters in public health program application has been, i mean application process has been started from april 11th last date to apply is around june 10th 2023 entrance exam will be held around in july from 1st to 10th declaration of results you can expect around july 20 counseling will start around july 25th see in university of lucknow there are two masters in public health courses one one is masters in public health community medicine the other one is masters in public health there is different eligibility criteria for mph and M- mph community medicine whenever you are applying please refer to both the eligibility criteria and whichever course you are interested in make sure that you tick that in your application form coming to university of lucknow masters in public health program there are two masters in public health courses in university of lucknow see one course is masters in public health community medicine the other one is masters in public health both the courses are two year courses you will have four semesters coming to mph you will have 50 seats coming to masters in public health community medicine you will have around 40 seats coming to eligibility criteria graduate with medicine ayush dentistry veterinary sciences allied health allied and health life sciences statistics biostats demography population studies nutrition social work are eligible to apply and have men- mentioned certain percentages for general obc and sc st if you are a student from the respected graduate disciplines you should have minimum 45 percentage of marks if you belong to sc and st category you should have around 40 percentage of marks 
coming to masters in public health community medicine any graduation degree holders are eligible to apply if you belong to general obc 45 percentage of marks sc st 40 percentage of marks there are many comments and queries regarding jitmar and nimhans notification first i would like to talk about nimhans nimhans notification is done recently the exam for mph academic year 2023 has also been done I don't know why many students have missed applying for NIMHANS. If you fulfill the eligibility criteria, please do apply. And for all the latest updates, make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. I have created Twitter account also. Make sure you follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Coming to JIPMAR, it is yet to be out. So far, JIPMAR MPH notification is not yet out. If this video is helpful for you, do like the video. For all the latest updates, do subscribe to the channel and click on the notification icon because as soon as we upload a video, you will get a notification so that you will keep a track on it and you will not miss out any video. And do share it with your friends who are interested in Masters in Public Health program. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram and Twitter for all the latest updates. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.